A ruler makes use of the majority, and neglects thy minority, and so he does not devote himself to virtue, but to law. Anfizi Anfizi was a Chinese philosopher. He was born in 280 before Christ and died in 233 BC. He was alive during the Warring States period of China, and had a strong legalist philosophy. He wrote a book called the Han Fizi, which contained many of his ruling philosophies. In Han Fizi's early life, he learned from another Chinese philosopher, whose name was Zunzi. Eventually, Fizi turned away from Zunzi to follow other philosophies. At this time, Han Fizi grew strong in his legalist ideologies. Fizi started writing his ideas down, and along with the philosophers of Shang Yang and Li Si, founded legalism. Han Fizi lived during the Warring States period of China, a time period of China where there was no formal ruler. Heavy warfare and destruction was prevalent throughout all of China during this time. During the Warring States period of China, seven primary states fought for control of China. The Chu, Han, Hui, Qin, Wei, Yan, and Zhao. The Qin turned out victorious shortly after the death of Fizi. Fizi was born a royal into the Han state of China. Legalism was greatly developed by Fizi. Fizi believed that rulers should rule harshly, give large punishments to small crimes, give large taxes, use censorship, and have a tough dictatorship. Legalism was developed during the Warring States period, but was put into action during the Qin Dynasty. Legalism believes humans are ill willed by nature, and will do right from fear of punishment rather than being moral. Under legalism, the first priority shall always be government. According to Han Fizi, a filial son to his father can be a traitor subject to his ruler. Han Fizi's desire for a strong government was most likely because there was little to no government when he was alive. Prior to Fizi's era of China was the Zhao Dynasty of China. The two major philosophies and religions of the Zhao Dynasty were Taoism and Confucianism. Taoism was a religion in ancient China, and although it has many differences with legalism, Fizi may have gained some influence from it. Confucianism, which was founded by Confucius in the 5th century before Christ, can be described as the pure opposite of Fizi's mindsets. Confucius wanted a small government with strong families, while Han Fizi wanted a civilization that would be loyal to their government even before their family. Although he was born with the name Han Fei, Z was added to the end of his name as an accolade for being an honorable philosopher of China. Many of Fizi's works were written in the Han Fizi, but he also had some political writings in the Tao Te Ching, a holy script for Taoists. These writings gained the attention of the king of the Qin state. The Qin state of China and the Han state of China went to war. Fizi was captured and trapped by the Qin, and left to live in the Qin dynasty. A philosopher named Li Si, who also helped in founding legalism, convinced the king that they could not send Fizi back, or he would be a strong threat, nor could they keep him, as he would most likely be a traitor. Li Si proposed a solution. An Fizi was forced to drink poison, which killed him. Overall, An Fizi was a very honorable and interesting figure in Chinese history. He had a substantial role in the creation and growth of legalism. He would influence China many years after.